we have a catalog of 15,000 of these courses uh, from close to a thousand universities. Our, our users have written over 100,000 uh, reviews. So now you can read the reviews to find which courses uh, is good for you. Class Central builds itself as the trip advisor of online education. There are currently 15,000 courses from 940 schools linked on the site. Many are completely free. The classes are called MOOCs, or Massive Open Online Courses. From my personal recommendation, I would say my favorite course is Learning How to Learn. So if you're new to online learning, uh, I would it's a one, one four week course, uh, but if you want, you could binge it within a day. Class Central currently lists nearly 450 free online Ivy League courses. The topics range from the pyramids of Giza to machine learning and everything in between. The site also maintains a best of list that has lessons from all over the world. There's another move uh, taught by Dr. Chuck, which is Intro to Programming. It's for people with almost uh, zero or no experience in programming. It's a very gentle start to programming. Um, also, there are my, my machine learning course. Uh, it's it's a bit more technical, but it's for, it's from the founder of Coursera, the largest MOOC provider in the world. Uh, it, it was the course that actually created the platform itself. So it was one of the first courses on the platform. I would definitely recommend that if you're into technology. Shah has seen a huge uptick in class takers since the COVID-19 crisis. Colleges are also creating courses specifically to educate online learners. We actually got 10 million learners as soon as quarantine went into place and people were trying all kinds of courses. Uh, what we noticed was generally university, universities like Yale, Harvard, MIT, they got people are more interested in brand name universities as much as the content of the course. So these platforms, uh, these universities uh, got a big share of the enrollments, uh, but they're also what the the universities have also done is they have reacted and launched many courses that help you understand the COVID situation. So there are almost 30 courses related to coronavirus, uh, one even from Harvard, Johns Hopkins, and some other international universities. Very few courses offer college credit, and the ones that do can be costly. Most of the courses won't have graded assignments and the lectures will be pre-recorded. There are more structured premium courses that include a certificate when you finish. Classes range from $50 to $200, but Shah says that many employers may not value the certificate. I see this certificate as an add-on to what you already have and might help you stand out, but I, don't, I still don't think we are at a place where just because you have a certificate, uh, you will get hired. What it might do is increase your chances of getting interviewed or getting your foot into the door, but you still need to have the skills yourself to get past beyond that. Shah has a master's degree from a traditional college, but has completed over a dozen courses in online learning since graduating. He says the key to online learning is to treat it like exercise. In the end, the onus is on you. You have to follow along and do it uh, regularly for it to have a real benefit in your, uh, in your life. So I think learning isn't something that uh, just a few tips will help you. It's, it's practice and dedication, and you need to figure out especially in online, you need to sort of motivate yourself. Invest in you. Ready, set, grow. CNBC and Acorns.